Okay, as uh, promised, uh, we're going to do a cold start on uh, my 94 uh, C4. I'm walking over here, I'm touching the uh, exhaust manifolds. Everything is cold. It's been sitting like this ever uh, since the photo shoot. I would like to show you the um, condition of the oil. Still looks like that nice honey color. Okay, let's, um, by the way, this is how it's stored um, every single day, uh, month after month and year after year. Um, by the way, I am including this, um, this uh, California pop top cover. Okay, uh, as far as the key fob goes, when you walk up to the vehicle, and or get out and step away, it does automatically lock and unlock the car. Um, the buttons, however, uh, don't seem to be working. For example, if I hit the unlock on the key fob, we'll call it that, it doesn't seem to be unlocking. And I try the hatch and it doesn't, um, it doesn't unlock. But in any case, you got, uh, you got the key to unlock the door manually. Um, here goes the cold start. Okay, so I'm going to uh, back out the car and I'm going to have my um, part-time cameraman who doubles as my son um, show you that um, there are no drips uh, or leaks as I am backing out. No liquids, just a, a dusty floor. Okay, so I've backed out of the driveway. It has been running now for approximately five minutes. Um, just wanted to show you the gauges. Oh, why is that? Oh, uh, there we go. You can... Uh, I wanted to show you the, the stereo works. the headliner um, I had to get it reupholstered uh, because uh, you know over, being this old the glue just uh, starts to give way but hopefully you can uh, get a good idea what it looks like uh, one other thing I want to point out is um, 
the uh, armrest uh, console here, the pad. Um, the original one, as um, all you vet owners know, um, was not designed very good and the rubber started separating. So um, this is an aftermarket one. Uh, it's kind of grainy. It's not the smooth leather uh, like uh, what came with the car. Okay, so I wanted to point out uh, there's there's no water dripping as um, you folks saw in photo number, I believe 68. Uh, again, it was just residual water after a nice uh, sudsy bath. I um, also want to point out uh, this is um, an aftermarket piece too. The original one was a, uh, I didn't like the condition of it, so I purchased um, a new one, uh, Valance here. Um, also, it has a uh, K&N air filter. I installed that shortly after I uh, took possession. So uh, here's the hatch when it's open. Um, I also have this bracket right here that um, I used to use when I took the target top off. It allows, as you well know, you Corvette owners out there, it allows the um, hatch to stay open to let the wind through so it doesn't um, reverberate around in the uh, cabin. This comes with it too. Um, really the only thing this car needs, I'm gonna show you right now. Um, I wanna point out right here. And uh, for those C4 owners, you know exactly what I'm talking about. This is separated right here. Also on the other side, this is the only thing uh, that this car needs is just a new seal. And I'll take you to the other side and show you. Right here. So this is the passenger side. And I think um, that is about it. I uh, hope you enjoyed the video. Um, if you need me to uh, show anything else, uh, don't hesitate to um, let me know.